The victim died on the spot due to internal bleeding. The investigating team arrived at the crime scene and thought of using a 3D scanner for further references and reconstruction process. The principle on which the 3D scanner works is that it emits a beam of infrared laser light onto a rotating mirror that effectively paints the surrounding environment with light. With the Faro laser scanner, we were able to create photorealistic full-color 3D diagrams for prosecutors to use in the court. These images help the members of the jury to gain a perspective on what the actual scene looked like that was just not possible with the 2D diagrams. 3D laser scanning technology is transforming crime scene investigation. It allows you to capture complete, accurate views of the on-scene evidence and generate photorealistic 360-degree views of the space. Some advantages are that it reduces officers in time needed to record a scene, preserve critical evidence faster, easy to use, and provide greater clarity to judges and prosecutors. After scanning the crime scene and saving the scan on the Faro, take your SD card out of the Faro Focus 3D laser scanning and place it in your computer. Transfer and open your project file and click on Import, and then start processing your scans, which includes processing settings as desired. After processing, registration takes place, in which stitching is done, where we merge all the different scans, which helps to compare scans from different angles. When scans are registered correctly, click Yes and finish. So this is how a crime scene looks like in the 3D scan. We can zoom in and out for better inference of the crime scene. So these type of scans can easily help in reconstruction. For instance, there is a mobile lying on the left side of the body and a pen on the right side. In India, it is generally used by police forces and other investigating agencies.